Okay. Um, well, Nathan, first 10 minutes of the second half ultimately decided it. I, I think probably the first two minutes of the, the, the half, I, I sort of decided it really because I, I, I thought we looked we were excellent first half, really did think structurally we were very, very good. Um, got into real good areas without really, really scoring, which is the, the main thing. But then I think it rocked us, never mind the second goal, the first goal really rocked us because we wanted to come out, we wanted to be on the front foot and there weren't, weren't real urgency. And then to concede in the manner that we did was really, really disappointing. And that's that's the thing that's, that's disappointing really, is, is to concede in the manner that we did. Um, but look, in terms of overall, it, it's not a bad performance, but we can't concede goals. You know, that's what happened last year. And then they had to chase games and, and score three to get up. That's, that's not what we've been about. Look, Stoke have real quality in the side. You know, you look at the front three, Powell, Fletcher, Campbell, a real, real quality. I know that because two of them I, I had. Um, so, and, and we give them that time and, and, and that space and they punished us. We, I'd ironically, had more possession, more time in the final third, more shots, more crosses, more corners, more everything than they did. It just couldn't find a, find a way through. So it showed that structurally it's, it, you know, there's a lot of positives to be taken, but we have to be better in both boxes. Well, he changed personnel and shape and had, and had to go, and it was one of those you felt if he got one, you, you might go on and get the second. Yeah, the trouble was getting one, um, and, and that was the thing. The keeper was in you know, great form, pulled off some really wonderful saves because it did Harry and from, I think it was Pelly Ruddock, and, and it's just we lacked a little bit of edge today, second half. First off, I thought we were excellent, really proud of the performance, how we played, we showed that we, you know, we can come up against a very, very good side and a, and a very, you know, expensively assembled side and compete quite comfortably. It, it's just in, in the clinches, in the nitty gritty, when the, you know, that, those margins, you can't, you can't give real, and Fletcher's a top striker, you know, especially for this level, and you can't give him that space back stick because he'll punish you. Um, and Morel, when he came on, um, if there's a positive, I'm sure there were plenty, and he's certainly one of them. It, it, uh, um, undoubtedly, I thought he was excellent when he came on, real bright sparks, showed exactly what we know he can do. Um, it's just what we, you know, there are so many positives, it's hard to, to think about him and have them now because we just lost a game and we've conceded and stuff. But when I evaluate everything, there will be masses of positives in, in, in that because first off, I thought we were, we were excellent, even, you know, some of our play second off, structurally we were very good. It's just we lacked, we lacked the necessary quality to, to score the goals. Speaking of scoring goals, no James Collins today. What's the situation with him? Well, look, he's, he's not been well, so we've had to test him, and then we just waited on results. You know, in, in a normal world, he wouldn't feel well. He felt better today, so we would have played him. Can you play? Yeah, I can play, but this is not a normal world anymore. So we've just had to pull him out and and test him. So we're waiting on the results of the, uh, of the test. So he has to sort of stay away whilst all that's going on, presumably? Yeah, in this day and age, that's, that's basically what you have to do, you know. Uh, if you have a snivel, then you have to report it, and you, you and your ten mates have got to isolate. So it, whatever it is, you know, we have to stick to protocols, which we have, and, uh, and that's why he wasn't involved today. But he might, and others might be available for, for Tuesday, because it, it starts a real run of matches now. Well, look, we, we will have more available for Tuesday because obviously the the two that we signed yesterday on deadline day will be available. Um, the uh, hopefully, you know, we've, we've still got Bree Potts and that to come back as well, and we're hoping that that's going to be a little bit sooner rather than later. Um, and then look, and then and then we go from there. Look, it's, it's, I'm really disappointed at the minute because of the result, but there'll be a lot of positives in that in that performance today. Thank you. Cheers.